The Wisconsin Senate is set to vote on two bills that would make penalties stricter for drunken driving, but it would also increase prison costs. The first bill calls for a mandatory minimum five-year sentence for homicide by driving intoxicated. And the second calls for an increase in prison time from six months to 18 months for a fifth or sixth offense. State prison officials estimate that if both bills are passed, they will generate more than $14 million in operating costs annually. Senate approval would send the first bill to Governor Tony Evers and the second to the Assembly.